Hey everybody! So recently this new laser dive hit the market, which is a 25 watt red laser. But the interesting thing about it is it's supposed to spit out two laser beams. So I, uh, I found that really interesting, so I went ahead and bought one. So yeah, today I'm going to build this into this host and have some fun. The parts that I'll be using to build this are definitely suboptimal, but it's all I have on hand, so I'm going to have to make it work. Now this is the uh, Mini Saber host. Uh, so it's a host I really like. It uses two double A's. And then uh, this is my uh, laser diode module, and these are my buck drivers, the uh, x ray I'll be using one of those. So yeah, this is what I'll be using to build the laser. It turns out that the x drive doesn't seem to work on anything less than 4 volts, which means that my plan configuration is not going to work out. So I'll probably just power this laser directly off this power supply. So oh well. Now I have the laser directly hooked up to the power supply. And as you can see, when I feed it some juice, it spits out a lot of red light. But it's not directly apparent from this uh, raw output that's spitting out two beams. So I'll stick a lens on it and see what happens. So I put a lens on the front to focus the output, and as you can see it's spitting out three beams. That is the weirdest thing. I've never seen anything like it before. Very, very cool. What cool things can you do with a three beam laser? How about lighting three matches at once? Awesome. On the right is my 5 watt 650 nanometer laser, then on the left is my uh, new tri-beam laser. Even though the one on the right is much stronger, they're about the same brightness simply because of the eye sensitivity to uh, 638 nanometers, which is the laser on the left. So yeah, this is pretty cool. I'm honestly curious about what the application is for some weird laser like this with such crappy beam specs and, and three beams. I'm not sure, it's probably just an efficient red light source. Well, that's about it for this video, but until the next time, stay safe and happy lazing.